Tau hina ia ele ele me kapukai O malumalo kapo Ka mahe lani ma eo eo na mea apau Ku me ka ohe mea kavika Ho ike e nau ke ea Ho ike e ka lele pue o ke ao makua Aina ka pū o kukui lani kaula e mahia lani haku Makali'i ka hoku e ka pū e pū Makani luna e ka pū e pū E paa ke ho ike ana Evelina mai kako My name is Brandon Kavika Foster And I am the Po'opua'ahara primary apprentice of Maikungu My teacher Lawrence Kalainia Kamani Aki he is the 50th generation of teachers from the Valley of Halava on the island of Molokai. We have a halau, a school called Mano Kahiko, the spirit power of our ancestors. This school preserves the wisdom and knowledge of our traditional Hawaiian lineage. The Moku o Hau Hau is a chant of our school genealogy. It shares an order for myself all 50 generations of teachers within our lineage. It establishes the authority of the knowledge that we speak. I always say when people come to learn these teachings, you did not come to listen to me, you came to listen to them. Nanai Ke Kumu, Look to the Source, is a teaching that has been handed down throughout the generations. The source is that of our elders, our teachers, and our ancestors. Till today, this knowledge and wisdom is taught through the oral practices of our ancestry, traditions such as Hula, the dance, Oli, the chants, and Mo'olelo, the stories. It's through these traditions that we learn how key concepts such as aloha, pono, and pa'a interweave with each other. Hula is the rhythm, the pulse of our people. Through the ancient and modern forms of hula, history is preserved. Knowledge on all levels can be passed down. For those that dance the hula, it becomes a means of communicating to all the elements of nature. Hula becomes a dialogue in the space of silence between the dancer and the universe. Another fundamental teaching of our lineage is Aloha Ikikahi Ikikahi, which means to love one another unconditionally. Hawaiians were taught to listen and hear their intuition way before any intellectual education began. We learn by watching, by listening, and by doing as our ancestors did in order to get to a place where we know. To love and care for everyone and everything as there is no separation between man and nature or land and the sky. We learn how to connect to the source by understanding our relationship to all things in this universe. We understand this relationship to be ohana, family. This is aloha. We all have a spiritual connection. It gives us a purpose and a reason to live. This connection enables us to be humble, patient, and willing to do the work that needs to be done. It is so simple, yet our lives have made it so complicated. We are here to acknowledge the spirit in all things and to have a reverence for life. This is Pono. Pohaku or stones prevent us from knowing and dim our light. The light of the source that shines through us and provides us with all that we need. Stones or baggages are cleared regularly through the healing practices of Ho'oponopono, Lomi Lomi, Hula, and Oli, prayer and Hana, the work. These practices allow us to return to the line of truth and create a foundation in the belief of our ancestors that is unshakable. This is Pa'a. As the 51st generation, it is my responsibility to preserve with integrity the wisdom of my ancestors. I master this knowledge in order to ensure the path is visible for the next generation. If we follow it, we'll discover they have always been with us. Someone once asked me, what does the spirituality of your ancestors mean to you? I took a moment to think about this question, and in that moment I wrote down what came to me, and when I read my answer aloud, I found a stronger appreciation for the wisdom of my ancestors. From the depths of my consciousness, I reached down to the peak of my being to understand that which has always been there, the spirit of my ancestors within. <laughs>